Hi, I'm David with General Air. I get asked quite a few times, what's the difference between MIG and TIG and when do I use one or the other? Well, today we're going to show you the perfect project for MIG welding. The project that we're doing is a fire pit. I don't have any special tools or anything like that. I've got this scrap 3 inch material and just with an angle grinder, we're going to try to make a nice little bowl for our wood to sit in. So I've got a basic design here and I'm going to measure this out later on, but I'm going to make a cut here and I'm going to make a cut here and of course on the lower side and this will be the bottom of our pan where our wood's going to sit in. Then we're going to fold these all up and weld them together. All right, our fire pit is beginning to take shape here. As you can see, we cut out a few triangles and just started folding things together. I used an angle grinder with a cutoff wheel to cut some reliefs at the base of these triangular shapes. And then I was able just to fold them together. Now I've got the sides tack welded and then things are looking pretty good. So let's do some welding. All right, so here's what needs to be welded on our project. I'm going to be using an 035 solid steel wire, about 250 inches per minute at 19 volts. I'm going to start from the top and I'm just going to weld all the way to the bottom. I still have a little overhang here for when I folded up my material. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to cut this material off right here and I'm going to weld on a plate all across the length of the fire pit and that's where I'm going to weld some handles in order to move this thing around. Whew, that was a lot of work but a really really fun project that was made easier by welding with the MIG process. Now there's a couple other things that I'm going to do on here. I'm going to put some handles and we're going to play around a little bit with the legs. They're just tacked on right now. Here's the fire pit. It is flipped over right now. Here's the feet. I've got a couple of things that I still need to do on it. The areas where we ground the edges so where we could bend the sides, I'm going to go ahead and weld those uh, so the fire pit has rigidity. And then also weld the legs on. They don't fit quite so well just because kind of chewed them off, but that's all right. We've got a gap in here and we'll just use a little back and forth pattern and get these filled up and it'll be ready to go. Here it is, all complete. And yeah, it is a little rough around the edges, but that was really the point. Just goes to show that with a couple of hand tools, a MIG welder, and some imagination, you can make anything you want. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed our video, like, comment, and subscribe. If you wanna see what we're doing or see what we're up to, we're also on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Thanks so much.